Hello and welcome to my new video. Today I'm going to play 10 of my favorite riffs. And by my favorite riffs, I actually mean the riffs that I have written uh, for bands that I have put together. So if you were hoping to hear me play Stairway to Heaven and stuff like that, that's not this video. However, if you don't know any of my songs, Please stay with me and have a listen and hopefully you will like what I'm what I'm got to uh, play today. Just to sort of uh, put a bit of a background around it. So I have been in bands for over 20 years now actually and I have been you know putting bands together and, and writing lots and lots of songs and lots of riffs and I have chosen 10 that I think are really good to me anyway, I really like them, so I'm just going to go ahead and play them. This first song is from a band that I put together a long long time ago, uh, back in the 90s, uh, which was called Dzieci Stanu Wojennego, uh, which the, the name of the band is in Polish and you know I lived in Poland in, in, at that time, and what this actually means in English is uh, Children of the Martial Law. This was based on the fact that I was born in, in, in a year where we actually had martial law uh, introduced in, in, in Poland. Um, so yeah, so that was, that, that was sort of the basis for the, for the band name. Um, but this particular song is actually about uh, the um, conflict in the Middle East and how it sort of affected me and how I, how I looked on, at the news in those days and I was really sort of, you know, appalled I suppose by the violence that was going on and sort of perpetual violence uh, and you know I, I really I really wished that it had stopped um, so this so anyway this this led me to to developing this uh, intro which for which I now know that it's sort of it's it's called an Arabic scale but because I'm self-taught it wasn't really that obvious I just kind of played the notes that sounded right. So first of all, listen to the intro. So that's the intro. So you can hear that sort of Arabic influence and the use of the Arabic scale actually leading to some kind of like a bossa nova uh, kind of pattern, which is again something that I kind of came up with and I put the two together. So then the song expands into more of a heavy riff based on those two concepts. So I'm just going to play that to you now. Here it goes. <laughs> have a bridge that goes like this. And the last part of the song actually changes. So there's another riff that goes at the end of the song and it goes like this
the song number two is actually a song that was called Burzliwe Związki, which, which actually is translated into English as stormy relationships, you know, and it actually it does, uh, it does describe what it says on the tin, really. And this song, I'm just going to change that guitar back to the clean setting again. Um, it actually has a kind of uh, more of a funky vibe at the beginning, you know, so I was kind of trying to go for that, you know, despite the fact that sort of we, we're sort of, a, a, well, described as a punk band, I suppose. At the time, I was really trying to go for that sort of funky, funky vibe and add that to, to this particular song. So I came up with this uh, prog uh, uh, chord progression um, and it goes like this. So there you have it. So those two, those two songs or two riffs uh, were from my first band that I've ever put together. This next song is from, from a band that I actually put together here in the UK and the band was called Rebel Conspiracy. Uh, and this song I would like to dedicate to Lee from a band Eilika because I know that he's a big fan of the song. So Lee, this one's for you. This is Burn the World. Okay, and then it goes into that sort of more of a heavy riff. like about this song in particular is the chorus and the chord progression in the chorus so I'm just going to play that for you now <laughs> From the chorus, it goes in back into the fast riff. So the chorus goes like this. So that's Burn the World. The next song 
that I would like to play for you for, from the same band, Rebel Conspiracy. It's called They Control You. <laughs> So that's they control you. From here, I'm going to move on to the next band that I uh, put together, which was called Manifest. So, for Manifest songs, I'm going to switch the guitars uh, because in Manifest we actually played in a different tuning, and the tuning was drop C. We really wanted to achieve that really, really heavy sound. All right, the guitar has been changed. So now I'm going to play to you an intro from our first album. Uh, so this is, uh, the album was actually called Still Relevant. It's an intro that goes into a song called Open Your Eyes. This song also has an outro part to it, and it goes like this. So there you have it. This is Open Your Eyes or the riffs from Open Your Eyes by a band that I had uh, called Manifest. The next song that I would like to play here today is also by Manifest and it's called The Modern World and it goes like this.
So I really like that riff, you know, it's kind of got that really sort of cool vibe going on and it's got a lot of groove going on on the drums. And then this song, uh, it's got kind of like a mid part, the verse part is sort of like a rappy style of vocal with the bass and the drums underneath. For the end of the song, I came up with another riff, which I really like. I think it's a really cool, cool riff and a cool progression of notes. So I'm just going to play it to you now. So yeah, so this is how it goes, it kind of repeats itself at the end. And the next song that I would like to play to you is also by Manifest. And this one's called Still Relevant. It's from the second album called The Pathway to Resistance. So this, this riff that I came up with, it's quite, it's quite a thrashy riff and it goes like this. So that's kind of the main riff uh, for that song. The next song is going to be by my most recent band called Sonnet 13. And I really like this song. This, is, this, is, this song is called As One and it actually talks about everybody being equal, that everybody should be treated in the same way, that we are all one human race, you know, and there isn't really a place for racism in this world. And in racism or discrimination in any form, you know, we we are one basically. That that was that was the meaning, uh, and the yeah behind behind the title title of the song. This is called as one. That's the main part of the song, the verse and the chorus. And this next part is a fast, is a faster bit. And the riff that that I came up with was inspired by some of the death metal bands that I listened to some years ago. <laughs>
So there you have it. This is As One by Sonnet 13, a song that I wrote for that band. The next song that I decided to include in the 10 favorite riffs of mine is called Still on This Journey. It's also by Sonnet 13 and the lyrical idea for this song was kind of that co continuous musical journey that I've been on over the years. But actually, you know, like I said earlier, being in bands, writing songs, playing gigs, you know, getting to places. So really, this is what it's about. This is called Still on This Journey. And there you have it. This one's called Still on This Journey. I really like the, the, how, how the song actually is. Um, and, and it's really groovy, you know, the, the, whole, the, the, the whole idea and all the riffs it really, really appeal to me. The last song I decided to include in this video is also by Sonnet 13 and it's called Identity. And it goes like this.
These were 10 of my favorite riffs that I have written over the years for various bands. Thanks very much for watching and for listening. I hope that you enjoyed it and you like the riffs and you like the songs. And if you do, please give the video a thumbs up. And also please subscribe to the channel as it really helps me grow and develop it. Thank you and see you next time.